The introduction of the new worker fine buses is part of the integrated and resilient urban mobility project aimed at easing urban mobility challenges in the country's capital, Freetown. Initially, these buses were operated on a ticket-based system. However, less than six months in, plans to digitalize bus access are now underway with the installment of card swiping machines at bus entrances. This development has sparked significant dissatisfaction among ticket sellers who fear that it will lead to unemployment and financial difficulties impacting their livelihoods. It will affect me a lot because, like, for me, so. This will affect us a lot because, for me, before Wakafan started operations, I used to do a business which is not lucrative at all. But now, this new change, which they promptly inform us about, will cause me to return to my former life. But the thing just don't come on a short time now they can't tell you they can't pull the tickets and put the card. If we stop selling tickets, that will affect us a lot. Because for me, I have a lot of responsibilities to fulfill and mouths to feed at home. Selling these tickets help us a lot mainly as young people. It reduces idleness and lawlessness, especially the intake of illicit drugs. Apart from that, it greatly helps in income generation for us, as we have many responsibilities to handle and also the responsibilities of other people to shoulder. So if this stops, that will cause a huge problem for us. While many see this new system as a significant step towards digital transformation, others view it as a move that will create unemployment and pose challenges for the country's largely illiterate and technologically unexperienced population. Joseph Adumambu, AYV News, Freetown. But this way we do, I'm so. We do to manage ourselves. But so long we don't the yagi say that God for can condemn this ticket. We say we're not happy for that because now they would get we have half money.